But we all know what nostalgia is. It's probably one of the best things, especially when it comes to video games. And today I'll be talking about the most nostalgic video games of all time. Let's get into it. First of all, we probably have one of the most nostalgic and popular video games of all time. We got Minecraft. Now, if we're being realistic, this game is basically running off nostalgia. I mean, when we play this game, we're practically blinded by it. Now, a lot of people make it seem like it's a bad thing. But in reality, it reminds us of simpler times, and it proves to us that video games don't need fancy graphics or a really cool story to it. All they need are good times. Next up, we have a game that is somewhat similar to Minecraft, and that would be Terraria. Now, Terraria also does kind of run off nostalgia, if we're being realistic, because you are doing the same thing, kind of like Minecraft, but with more bosses, and uh, you don't have to worry about dying and losing all your stuff. Now, because once you complete this game, you know, after a couple of times, it does get boring, so it is kind of brainwashed by nostalgia too, but there is a lot of nostalgia, and the soundtrack is one of, if not the best soundtrack of any video game I've ever played, and also, it is just in general a very good game, and like Minecraft, I do tend to go through a lot of Terraria phases, but definitely a nostalgic game for sure. Next up, we have Skyrim. Now, Skyrim, like the other two games I've mentioned in this video so far, it runs off nostalgia because once you complete it once, you're kind of just doing the same thing over and over again. But still, there's a lot to unpack in this game. It's very fun, has a good story, and is very funny because there's a lot of glitches and bugs that, believe it or not, they've actually fixed before. But the community got so mad because the glitches aren't even glitches. At this rate, they're just happy accidents. Next up, we probably have one of the most popular and one of the best games that Rockstar Studios has created. That would be GTA San Andreas. Now, this game is just straight up iconic. The characters, the story, the game in general is just iconic and full of pure nostalgia. Because the game was ahead of its time and probably the most popular game that came out. Well, whenever this game came out, I actually don't remember when it came out. But I know it was most definitely the most popular game when it did come out. Because people are still talking about it to this day. Next up, we have Fallout New Vegas. Now, Fallout New Vegas, in my opinion, was probably the best Fallout game of all time. It had the best music, one of the best stories, and everything about it except the graphics was an easy 10 out of 10. Now, this game is pure nostalgia because, one, people are still talking about it and still playing it to this day. And two, when you just play the game, especially a game like this, when you play that story or just play any mission in this game... You just get like this feeling of nostalgia, you know what I mean? Next up, we have a video game that I think everyone, and I mean everyone, all 7 billion people on this earth know. And if you don't, you've been living under a rock for the past like 30 years. Because the game I'm talking about is the original Super Mario Bros. Now this one makes sense, because who doesn't know who Mario is? I mean, he's practically one of the most iconic, if not the most iconic, video game character of all time. Next up, we have the first ever Pokemon game, and that would be Pokemon Red and Blue. Now, if you grew up playing this game, this game just has to be nostalgic. I mean, it was probably one of the first video games to ever come out. And the last game on this list today is one that I think we all know, and that a lot of people, especially people that play guitars, love. And if you haven't guessed it, I'm talking about Guitar Hero. Who doesn't love this game? Because it used to be like an actual game before it just kind of retired as an arcade game. But this game will forever go down the gaming hall of fame as probably one of the best video games out there. I mean, this game is one of the things that actually got me into guitar. Well, that's all I have for you for you guys today. So if you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next one.